Good morning, people. George Luck here, man. Right in early grind. Five oh five, sitting outside the gym, just you know, contemplating what I'm gonna go ahead and do, man. Trying to get my mind right today. But uh, it's been a while, man, since I gave y'all a video. So I'm gonna uh, go ahead and get this tea out, man. And this is just something that this is on my mind, man. And my heart's heavy right now, man. I got some things that, that I'm dealing with that uh, I just can't seem to shake. But it is what it is. Life goes on, man, you know. But um, there's two type of people in this world, man. There's the doers and there's the doubters. You know, and today I just want you to ask yourself, you know, who are you? Are you a doer or are you a doubter? And, and what I mean by the doers is the people that, you know, that they do it. By no means, whatever it takes. Whatever is on your mind, whatever it has to get done, you get it done. There's no excuses. There's no if ands. There's no buts. There's no, I got to babysit. Oh, I got the kids. Oh, I got to go to work. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, I'm hungry. Oh, I'm sick. There's, there's no excuses. Oh, I'm too old. Oh, I'm too short. Oh, I'm too tall. Oh, I'm just, you know, there's none of that. You just go ahead and make it happen, man. Then there's the doubters. That's the people that always got an excuse. That's the Debbie Downers. That's the people that is just no matter what, nothing ever can get right, you know, and, and, and they blame others. They want to blame society. They want to blame their situation. They want to blame their parents. They just want to blame somebody else for the reason why they're where they are in life or, or the reason why you can't get fit, the reason why you can't work out, the reason why you don't have that job that, you know, that you feel that you should have. You go to work and you do the same thing that the other hundred people in your position do. Of course, you're not going to get promoted. Of course, you're not going to get a raise. You're not doing nothing different or abnormal than what everybody else is doing. You know what I'm saying? You work eight hours a day. You get 10 assignments done just like everybody else is required to do. What makes you special? You know, go in there and do 15 assignments. That way you'll stand out and, and, and be recognized and get to where you need to be. You know what I mean? But we don't do that. Those are the doubters, you know? And and you got to be a doer or you got to be a doubter. One of the two. You can't be in between. You can't be half in it. Because guess what? If you half ass in it, you might as well just be a doubter. Because that means you're only going half the time do something the right way. And half the time ain't going to get you no results. Half the time ain't going to put you where you want to be, you know? You got to just do it, man. Don't be a doubter, man. Stop coming up with the excuses. Stop. Just just stop. I'm just so tired of people, man, that, that, that just are doubters, man. Doubters, you know, and they want to play the blame game. They always want the pity party, you know. I'm just sitting quick and listening to somebody talk and this and the third, you know, all day long. Because, you know, doing what I do, man, being a health coach and, and helping others is part of helping them, you know, mentally, physically, emotionally, whatever is going on, you got to help them. You know what I'm saying? So I'm all for that. But when we're done talking, you know, at the end of the day, my conversation and then my last question for me is, so what do we do to change this? How can we make this situation better? You know, that's what needs to be done at the end of the day, man, because I'm a doer. I'm up 4 a.m. every day, man. The grind is real. It ain't easy. It ain't it ain't it ain't because, you know, I, I know that if I get up at 6 a.m., I can do this. No, I got to get up at 4 a.m. So I'm done by 6 a.m. So I can get to the people so I can help everybody else throughout the day. You know, some days I don't get no sleep. But hey, it is what it is. And I'm proud of what I do. I love what I do. You know, and I, and I get emotional about this sometime. And that's what I got to learn how to separate my emotions from what I got to get these actions done. You know, I can't say the world, but damn, I try. And I would love to, you know what I mean? And, 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 and the world changes by just one person. You feel me? Why not me? Why not? So my question to y'all once again, man, is are you a doer or are you a doubter? Choose one and choose wisely. I'm sitting outside the gym, man, right now. It's 509, man. I, I could have been getting it in already. LA Fitness right there, man. I, I could have been in there getting it in already. But my man wasn't right, you know? So I'm going to go on in here. I'm going to get my man right. It's already good. I got this off my chest. It's arm day. You know what I mean? It's arm gauntlet, man. I'm just going to go in. 
all in, man. Holla at y'all. Once again, are you a doer or are you a doubter?